Uh, hi guys, so I'm going to play as uh, Barry Goldwater 1964. Um, so it, it's not possible to win as him on normal, but on, on easy it is possible, but it's apparent it's very luck based and there's there's no luck based questions, so I don't know, I'd have to try it over and over again. I think I have done it before though. Um, like a year ago or something like that. I can't even remember, but I, I had the screenshot of it on my old phone. I had, I had like 500 screenshots or something of it on my, uh, of all the campaign trail on my own phone. But, uh, I'll do it very easy. I'll do it. I'll play it on very easy because I just try that. You can. So the leader of the conservative wing of the Republican Party Barry Goldwater is perhaps the most controversial candidate uh, nominated for the presidency in recent memory. Goldwater has made his name on his staunch conservatism, arguing for security, social security reform, small government, and a halt to f further civil rights legislation. However, as beloved by his supporters as Goldwater is, the moderate liberal wings of the Republican Party have no love for him, especially after the long contentious primary that saw him narrowly defeat Nelson Rockefeller and his self-damaging vote against the Civil Rights Act of 1964. Goldwater finds himself in a precarious situation as the campaign begins, running against a popular incumbent, a radical reputation, and his own penchant for ugly gaffes. It will take skill, luck, and luck to even claw back at, into contention, let alone win. If he wants any hope at the presidency, he must find a way to minimize mistakes, appear, appeal to wary moderates, and pull together a party that has wholly fractured below him. So I, I used a guide again, but um, I'm pretty sure you can you just basically you just got to go left on. So like civil rights, you got to go left on and you want to unite Republicans and you want to go very right on economic issues that's what you want to do so william miller is the only vp like it's the only vp selection so you can win it on easy but it 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 takes a, it's very luck based there's no luck questions but it's still luck based the margins um so you want to say pivot to the left. Uh, extremism means patriotism. You want, you want to spam Pennsylvania. Yeah. Uh, devout Catholic. Yeah, it's, it's same with Johnson's. A lot of one word questions. Uh... Yeah, you want to unite Republicans. Uh, say, do the more centrist. Don't change your position. You look like a flip-flopper, but... Uh, every do every household. Uh, Counter-attack, Johnson. Uh, avoid talking about Humphrey and Bobby Baker. Uh, I used to think foreign aid was the one you want, but apparently it's, uh, you actually want to have farmers in the free market. Uh, reject your, oh yeah, you need to reject all the, uh, like KKK endorsements and that. Uh, yeah, say it's atrocious. Um, uh, great society. Yeah, that one. Uh, reject Bircherism. Yeah, that doesn't matter because you'll win on very easy. You'll win it by a lot in here. Yeah, remain silent. Uh, 
bunch of one word questions. Um, you want to be more centrist, but say volunteer system. Uh, winning the South. Actually, that may be bad. How much is New Hampshire? No, oh yeah, we're winning by a lot. Yeah, okay. Uh, about NAACP. Yeah, yeah, you win that by, by a good margin. I think by the south it means like the like Arkansas and the yeah I don't think you win that anyway. Uh, yeah, California is impossible apparently to win. Uh, say Arkansas. Yeah, we should win this. Unless like the mar like the luck margins are crazy. I I won by a fair amount last time. I mean, whoever was the Republican nominee in real life wouldn't like wouldn't have won anybody probably would have been defeated by uh, uh Lyndon Johnson cuz uh, JFK got shot P pretty much anybody that uh, uh oh. yeah I think yeah you lose that in Pennsylvania And yeah, so you always you you win the popular vote very narrowly. Um, see, it's a big, it's a pretty big margin, but um, amazing. You defeated the odds and won the nineteen sixty four election. They said a miracle would be needed for Barry Goldwater to win, and it seems a miracle has taken place. Your supporters. Flood the streets as pollsters and pundits struggle to explain how this occurred. Assured competence, good fortune, and what seems like divine intervention, Barry Goldwater has won the election. Where you go from here is anyone's guess. Undoubtedly, your effectiveness will be decided by the makeup of Congress. It will certainly be another, yet another struggle to pass your agenda through the moderates and liberals that make up much of the government. But now sit back and relax, knowing you've pulled off a great, an upset greater than 1948. Uh, see, so yeah, next time I'm gonna do, I thought I was gonna do George Wallace 1968, but apparently I never did, uh, John Adams 1796, I never did that one. So I'm gonna do that one first, and, yeah, I think, yeah, then, then we do George Wallace 1968, I'm, I'm pretty sure. But, uh, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Uh, if you like, comments, subscribe, that'd be very appreciated, and I'll see you guys later.